Have you ever stopped to ponder why the letter A is at the beginning of our alphabet? What makes it so special? Indeed, there's more to this first letter of the English alphabet than meets the eye. Buckle up as we embark on a journey tracing the history of the letter A and unravel the reasons behind its awesomeness. Now, imagine the sands of time rewinding back to the ancient Phoenician era around the 11th century BC. Here, the letter A was not A, but Aleph, symbolizing an ox. Yes, you heard it right, an ox. The Phoenicians depicted Aleph as a head of an ox with two horns, which later on, through a series of transformations, became the A we know today. As centuries passed, around 800 BC, the Greeks adopted this Phoenician system of writing. They turned Aleph upside down, renamed it Alpha, and there we have the birth of the first version of our modern A. The Greeks were the first to introduce vowels in the alphabetic system, and Alpha was a vowel, marking a significant milestone in the history of A. Fast forward to the Romans, who embraced the Greek alphabet, and further refined Alpha into a simpler form, which closely resembles our contemporary A. They solidified A as the first letter of the alphabet, which has remained unchanged till today. Now you might be wondering why is A so special? Well, A is not just a letter, it's a symbol of beginnings, the pioneer of the alphabet. It's the most commonly used letter in English and several other languages, making it a cornerstone of linguistic communication. Moreover, A is versatile. It can represent a multitude of sounds, from the A in apple to the A in eight, it's a chameleon, changing its sound to suit its surroundings. A also holds a prominent place in music. In the world of tuning, A is the universal standard, the note that orchestras tune to. In mathematics, A is often used as a symbol to represent a generic element or a constant. This shows A's omnipresence not just in language but across multiple disciplines. In conclusion, A has been on a remarkable journey, from an ox in the Phoenician era to the most commonly used letter in the English language. It's a symbol of beginnings, a versatile sound maker, a musical standard, and a mathematical constant. How many letters can boast such a diverse resume? So the next time you see an A, remember the rich history it carries and the pivotal role it plays in our daily communication. Indeed, A is not just a letter, it's a linguistic superstar.